So here we are with Molly Coates of Coates Golf. Tell us a little bit about how last year exceeded your expectations for an inaugural event. So we always believed in Ocala and Marion County. We knew Golden Ocala could have, had the resources and the course to really have an LPGA event like this. Uh, although our expectations were blown out of the water because our crowd limits were huge, we filled up our overflow parking on Wednesday. So we've done a lot of planning for this year. Um, but we, we always knew Ocala and Marion County could do it. And you're expecting, you're hoping for 100,000? We're hoping for 100,000. Yeah, we had high five figures last year. Um, we've done a lot more marketing this year to really promote attendance. We also have a craft beer festival and a food truck bazaar. So it's really to get people who are not into golf as much to come to the event and enjoy golf. We have 12 food trucks coming, all different styles of food, plus we have 18 breweries, local, regional, and national, all bringing four to five beers to this crazy craft beer festival. Let's talk a little about your company just for a second. I know that you're trying to get into, well, you will be getting into this yes. year pretty soon. Talk about the distribution goals for this year. Absolutely. Distribution was our number one focus in 2015. Uh, we started with the green grass approach, but we quickly moved on to a big box approach because they have more boots on the ground we have more retail locations that we can move into instantaneously so we flew to Pittsburgh we had an initial meeting we got in on the first try which is really exceptional and we're really really proud of the brand for being able to do that so we will be in our first six Dick's locations January 31st all of which are in Florida they're actually four Dick's Sporting Goods and two Golf Galaxy locations but that was our number one focus for Coates Golf in 2015.